हाय थैंक यू सो मच वी आर बैक विद अनदर इंटरेस्टिंग टॉपिक बफर सॉल्यूशन सो आफ्टर अ लॉन्ग टाइम ऑलमोस्ट टू मंथ्स अगो आई पोस्ट द लास्ट वीडियो आई मीट एन एक्सीडेंट सो दैट्स व्हाई आई केम हियर लिटिल बिट लेट बट नो वरीज टुडे आवर टॉपिक इज बफर सोल्यूशन बफर सोल्यूशन इफ आई सेड मोर प्रिसाइजली आई सेड पी एच बफर और हाइड्रोजन बफर इज एन एक्व सोल्यूशन कंसिस्ट ऑफ मिक्सचर ऑफ अ वीक एसड एंड इट्स कंजुगेट बेस और वाइस वर्सा मीन्स एन एक्व सोल्यूशन हैविंग अ वीक बेस और अ कंजुगेट एसिड और वीक एसिड और अ कंजुगेट बेस सो दिस इज कॉल्ड बफर सोल्यूशन हेयर इज अ सिंपलेस डेफिनेशन ऑफ बफर सोल्यूशन एनी सोल्यूशन विच रिजिस एनी चेंज इन पी एच means ph is little bit change but the task of ph solution of buffer solution is to resist while adding small amount of acid or base is called buffer solution so there are two types of buffer solution one is acidic buffer and other one is basic buffer what's the process of their formation also we are discussing salt and weak base by the combination of a salt or a weak base they make a basic buffer on other hand acidic buffer salt salt how salt are made a strong base or a weak acid so by combination of a strong base and weak acid this makes a salt and this salt combines with the weak acid and this makes acidic buffer so this is the process of basic buffer solution and acidic buffer solution also examples example of acidic buffer is ch3 cwh is a acidic acid plus ammonium acetate the combination of both these make acidic buffer on another hand boric acid plus borox also makes acidic buffer so also example of basic buffer includes sodium hydroxide plus sodium chloride ammonium chloride sorry ammonium hydroxide and ammonium chloride both the combination makes buffers basic buffer other example is glycine and glycine hydro hydrogen chloride this pair also makes buffer solution this pair and this pair so these are the two two examples of acidic buffer and basic buffer here is the simplest and the basic concept line behind the buffer solution to maintain ph of any solution any solution we want to maintain its ph whether we are present in labs or industries buffer solutions are used this is the main purpose of buffer solution to maintain the ph of any solution so also i will also tell you the properties of a ph solution of a buffer solution sorry properties properties include definite ph means ph is almost defined and constant never change for a long time ph never change for a long time this is the point 2 this is the point 1 ph change but very slightly very slightly ph change almost uh, निग्लिजिबल निग्लिजिबल चेंज कम सो दिस इज द प्रॉपर्टी वेन एडिंग स्मॉल अमाउंट ऑफ एसिड और बेस वेरी स्लाइटली पी एच चेंज इन बफर सोल्यूशन सो बफर सोल्यूशन ऑल्सो यूज इन इंडस्ट्रीज फॉर केमिकल मैनुफैक्चरिंग एंड टू सेट फॉर डाइंग फेब्रिक्स ऑल्सो यूज फॉर फर्मेंटेशन प्रोसेसिस 
all the processes includes uh, buffer solution to maintain the ph basically the purpose is to maintain the ph where we need to maintain the ph of any solution we use buffer solution there so another topic how to calculate buffer solution capacity or efficiency the topic name is buffers capacity so the efficiency of a buffer solution to resist the change in ph is called buffer capacity so the formula of buffer capacity is denoted by beta and this is the formula delta b over delta ph ph is the solution any solution ph a lot of factors affecting buffer capacity means efficiency how much the percentage of efficiency comes means never 100% but it comes around 70 to 80% efficient two major factors on which buffer capacity depend ratio of salt acid or base that amount of acid or base we are adding in any solution this is the factor number 1 and other factor include total buffer concentration also uh, we are discussing here right now vans like equation so this is the very important equation also we can derive the equation in the next video but in this video we are discussing only the equation so two factors we are discussing ratio of salt we are added and total buffer concentration means a higher buffer concentration has greater efficiency means greater efficiency means maximum buffer capacity if uh, lower buffer if lower buffer concentration so automatically uh, efficiency also lower so this is the topic of buffer solution and buffer capacity hope you uh, hope you understand this topic very well inshallah we will meet in the next video Thank you so much